Dodge this. Hey guys, this is Dodger with The Game Station and you are watching Dodge This, which is my interview show where I talk to awesome people about the awesome things that they do. So today I have Jin Han, who does uh, some toy stuff and he's done comic book illustrations and coloring and all sorts of great stuff and has actually started his own studio called Yellow Tracksuit. So how are you? Good, how are you? You even have a hat yes. with it. That's awesome. That's, that's the Yellow Tracksuit logo, just so you all know. Um, so you've, I mean, you've worked on so many different types of projects. Like if you were to say that there's a certain type of project that you prefer working on, what, what would you say? Or would it, would you say that they're all, they all have their merits? Yeah, they're, they're all fun and unique in their own little ways, but I really have to think that uh, doing it in film or for animation is really Oh nice yeah? Fun. Yeah, just cause then we have a little bit more freedom to, you know, get a little bit more fantastic with the designs. Yeah, so it's, uh, it's always fun to have that kind of uh, freedom when we're working. Awesome. Have you had a, have you had a lot of opportunities to work on film? So, recently we did something with Spin Master, and uh, I don't know if you've heard of a property called Bakugan. Yeah. But uh, there's going to be a feature film that's you know we've done some, a lot of development work for that. Um, you know they have a director attached to it, and also you know it was a it was a cool experience. That was one of the later ones that we did. Um, we also have another one. Can't really talk about too much, but oh. <laughs> <laughs> you know we just started working on that this week. Um, Sweet. So yeah, they're they're always fun to work. on. So you're really excited oh, yeah. to work on this? Absolutely. What, what caused you to want to, to branch off and start your own studio? You know, it was just, um, I, I just have this, this burning desire to create, you know, create my own stuff. Mm -hmm. And my friends who I'm doing this with, we also, we all feel the same. And um, plus, to be honest with you, when you're working in, you know, either a corporate or, you know, just a, work, working under somebody else, it just gets a little bit tough. Yeah. Because you're spending most of your time you know, writing emails and being meetings and things like that. You know, when you're only actually designing for an hour or two a day, when you're hired as a designer, it gets a little discouraging. Mm -hmm. And so that was one of the reasons why I broke off and um, you know started doing this. So now you get to be your own boss and you get to actually feel like an artist again? Well, no, because I'm still writing emails and <laughs> <laughs> meetings eight hours a day, but it's mine. So, right. you know, it feels better. There you go. How long, how long has it been going? So we started uh, last year, 2010, in April. Awesome. Yeah, and um, you know it's it's been going great. We've uh, we've taken on quite a few big projects. Uh, this year we're actually hoping to double the workload that we had, so we're going to be expanding uh, here in a couple of months. Sweet. Uh, do you? So you have these animation projects coming up. Do you work on like all sorts of different projects at at your studio? Oh yeah. Uh, so we have. So we're working on a feature film. Um, very early film concept right now. Uh, we're, you know, we have toy projects going on. Um, we have, we always have our own uh, internal uh, IPs that we, we're developing. Mm -hmm. So, um, yeah, there's always a, a long list of things that we're working on. It could range from movies, toys, comics, you know, even book illustrations. So it's really okay. various. How do you keep that organized? It's tough. <laughs> I was gonna say that seems like that would be so hard to like keep straight, like to keep it all together. Yeah, that's why if there's anybody out there who is looking for an assistance position. <laughs> <laughs> you heard it here. Yellow tracksuit, contact him. So I, I saw on your, your portfolio online, um, you had some videos of you doing sketches and things at the Capcom booth at Comic-Con. How did right. that get started? How did you start doing that? Uh, a good buddy of mine, uh, his name's Eric Fan. He works over at Spin Master. Um, he has a friend of a Capcom and um, they, they just, started talking one day and said, hey, I've got this buddy who is a great artist. Thank you, Eric. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah, they just, they set it all up and I just got an email saying, hey, do you want to be uh, an artist at WonderCon? And that oh, was nice. last year. And after that, it went really well. He's a really great guy, uh, Francis, up at Capcom. And, you know, he invited me to Comic-Con the same year. Mm -hmm. uh, and then after that, it's just been back to WonderCon again. And then I'll be back in San Diego uh, at the Capcom booth. Gotcha. So I'll be sketching away. So if anybody <laughs> wants one, so I'll buy. Doodling all the time. Yeah. Um, is it is it stressful like to have people come up and have to do like a sketch right on the spot? Because it seems effortless in in the video, but is it like? No. Um, you know, it's it's really muscle memory at mm -hmm. that point because once you have you know you have people coming up to you saying, hey, I want Ryu, I want Cami, I want Guile, you know, or anyone else, then you just you just need to okay, well. I need guy I'll just make it down and at that point you've done so many that it just becomes automatic right yeah so it's, 
It's not that bad. <laughs> well, this actually has to be the end of our Game Station interview. But if you would like to keep watching Jin and I talk, uh, we're going to go ahead and keep talking for another like five minutes or so on my channel. Press Heart to continue. If you would like to go there, you can go ahead and click here on Vader. I'm so excited that the mask changes every time. It's so awesome. <laughs> uh, but otherwise, tune in next time to see who we have here next. And thank you so much for joining. Thank you. Bye.